There's oh, a- wow. I can't believe that's called that. that. What is he doing is to her? I'm above what it looks like. So ah, a woman's most sensitive area, okay? Her 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 okay. And so, um, anyway. Hey guys, Dave and Ashley Willis here from the Naked Marriage Podcast, and you're watching Fridays with Dave and Ashley, but today's is Freaky Fridays. It is a little Freaky Friday. With Dave and Ashley on the XO Marriage channel, where we talk about real marriage advice from real people. Subscribe to this channel by clicking subscribe below, and you can also go to xomarriage.com. A lot of you have written us, and you're like, listen, this is a very practical question. How do we spice up our sex lives? How do we learn new sexual positions without looking at porn? But some people, I think, have fallen into it just for instruction. They're just trying to learn some stuff. Well, we've got a great resource for you today. These guys aren't sponsors of our show or anything, but we have found something called positioncards.com. And they're these sex position cards. Like a deck of cards. Christian friendly. So you get these cards that are downloadable. Every position has the picture of like the guy in a gray stick figure, the girl's a pink stick figure. And then there's a QR code that you can scan and it gives you actual instructions about how these work. We're going to start with like three of the most common. Yes. And that would be... um, uh, missionary position, guy on top, cowgirl. They, I did not, you guys, I did not know this was called cowgirl. Thing. Cowgirl isn't get the girl just lay, woman laying on top. It's her kind of straddling him. Oh, like, like, like a horse. Like he's a horse, <laughs> right? And she's sort of straddling him. And so she gets to control all the action. You you really- I'm, I'm kind of like, really I'm resisting trying to not thrust this I told him, stuff. I said, you, you can't I'm not make- allowed to thrust, she said. So it's really been difficult. <laughs> But in, in Cowgirl, she's up so the guy gets a nice full frontal view. Right. And she's in control of the action and the, you know, all pacing. of that, the pacing. And so everybody wins. And then a third popular option is uh, doggy style. Is and that what they call it on the card? Oh, yeah. There are multiple variations of doggy style. Okay. There's one that's oh, it is. just doggy, doggy style. style. There we go. And then it's right. the woman on all fours, the man behind. Right next to that is one called dessert, where it's essentially doggy style from a seated position where the guy's sitting right. down and she's sitting on him and... I wonder why they named this dessert. Like, I just am fascinated by this, but all of these are doable if you can bend your knees, okay? You know, those are some I think we've heard of, but there's some on here that, I mean... I, okay, I, can I talk about the eagle? I'm looking I'm looking at the, the card over here. I don't know what's going on there or how even like... No, that, the eagle's not too far of a stretch. I know? guess you feel like you're flying and I guess it, it's really something because you fly like an eagle... That's right. That's right. I like the look of Fantastic Rocking Horse, where it's basically woman on top, man is like this is interesting on the bed, seated or on a couch or wherever. But and he's, you are rocking. He's sitting you up. Rock. He's sitting up, and she's straddling no him. <laughs> and they're rocking back but and you're forth. Rocking, and you feel secure in this position, right? Yeah, yes. security. Which let me just mention, we did a video about interesting places to have sex um, on our Instagram. If you want to go to at Dave and Ashley Willis, but several people on this talked about how certain. Beds are not created equal. Well, we your marriage, early in our like, marriage, one of my proudest moments, we broke an antique bed. We did. It was a really rickety bed, though. Let's talk about some really interesting acrobatic ones, you guys. I take Pilates, like, and I love it. I took dance and ballet. I'm a flexible person. Okay, some of these though, I don't even know how. If, right, if people can like, do this. Uh, there's ape. Which I'm Let not. Let me see eight. There's hand jive. Okay. That that isn't even That's not, all that well, flexible. That looks like she okay, is in, riding on him, like she's floating on him in a pool. In Drani. I feel like that's gonna hurt knees. Next to that now, is you guys jiggle and jam. Jiggle and jam. Think, what is happening? He's here? on his knees, like next to the bed. She is. You think there's a bed involved? Oh, see she's that? well, she's not floating, <laughs> or he, he he's not holding her like that. So <laughs> so. I she was legit, like her feet hooked. Oh man, maybe her she feet is. Are hooked around. Leave in the comments. Do you think, you guys, she's hooked around him? Oh, there's so much here, guys. I'm getting so many ideas. Lazy cowgirl. 69 sideways. So, oh. Atten Hut licking the flagpole. Cinema stroke. What food is called that? Pilates class. That what is he doing is to her? Insane. Can I talk about, too, with some of these guys, you can do it on the bed, do it on the couch. I mean, a chair. Mix Just, it up. You know, the kids aren't home. Sit on the chair. Sit on the couch. You're going to get, you know, back support in different ways. You're going to be able to feel different angles. And you might find some different moves or different right. angles that are just more pleasurable. You know, especially for a woman, sometimes can have what's called a tilted uterus. Maybe a traditional, just missionary style doesn't really achieve uh, what people refer to as like the G-spot. Like it doesn't get there. And so you want to try different angles. 
that get yeah. there, you know? And get yourself there. And that's why I like packing the suitcase oh my gosh. as an option. That makes me want to go on a trip if that's what packing me, the suitcase packing, looks like. That's a good stretch. Yeah, it's very... That's what we call happy baby. Can I say a funny meme I saw today on Instagram? There are like seven or 8,000 nerves in a woman's most sensitive area, okay? Like her clitoris? Her clitoris. Okay. If you're going to get on your, your wife's nerves, get on those nerves. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Continue to experiment with all this. Ask your spouse what they like, what they don't like, what they want to try. And maybe get these cards and just, you know, play a fun game of married cards and like pick one out and say, we're going to pick one out and try one tonight. In the comments um, of the ones we talked about, what sounds interesting? Comment on the position you find the most interesting or what your favorite is or, or what you want to try or the most, yeah, the most yes. shocking, just to give full credit where it's due. Yes. These all came from a website called positioncards.com, which is the number one source for Christian friendly sex positions, or at least that's their motto. For more fun, practical, and creative ways to make your marriage better, make sure you subscribe right here to the XO Marriage channel. We'll see you next time.